the national showdown over voting rights. Florida and Texas are the latest states to move forward with restrictive new voting laws. The GOP argues this is about keeping elections honest, while Democrats accuse Republicans of trying to suppress turnout, especially from minority voters. Senior Washington correspondent Mary Bruce has the latest. Good morning, Mary. Good morning, George. Well, across the country, we are seeing these Republican-controlled states following former President Trump's lead, moving to tighten election security laws. They say it's all intended to boost election security, but Democrats say it's all an attempt to fix a problem that simply doesn't exist because there was no evidence of widespread voter fraud in the last election, despite former President Trump's claims. Advocates say it all amounts to, to voter suppression, targeting communities of color and the disabled. Now, overnight in Texas, just a short while ago, they moved to advance measures that could make it the toughest state in the country to cast a ballot in. The, the bill would prohibit election officials from mailing out unsolicited absentee ballots and grant broad powers to partisan poll watchers. We've seen nine other states similarly roll back voting access. In fact, in Florida yesterday, we saw the governor there, a staunch Trump ally, make a big show of tightening their laws, signing a bill live on Fox News and shutting out all other media. George. Yeah, that was some move there. Okay, Mary, thanks very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.